So good morning and welcome to I've got what sort of Okay, so good morning and welcome to Weishan. Yes, here we are. This is absolutely stunning. I am so... the king of the mountain! <laughs> Guys, look at this beautiful door. All right, we'll go back out there, guys. Wow, this is really special to see. Wow. I'm actually quite jealous. I kind of want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> and it sounds beautiful, and here we are in the oasis. Wow, that is so cool. Oh, yeah, I love it. It's oh, yeah. so refreshing. I love it. That's awesome. Oh, thank you. I'm going to drink my one. <laughs> thank you. Look at that. Oh, writing at this. Is this the Thank mosque you. just in here? Or? This is all in Amazigh writing, the letters it's here. Tifina. Tifina. And I can see the Berber symbol there. Wow, yeah. beautiful, beautiful. Yeah. Ah. So, good morning and welcome to. I've got what sort of. Okay, so good morning and welcome to Weishan. Yes, here we are. It is it's so beautiful. How was tell us about the drive coming in? Like how Actually the drive here, in? we've just we've just seen the original road here behind yeah. us. So I was very pleased to see the new um, sealed road all the way and it was great. Yeah. There's, there's nothing wrong with it, like it's absolutely fine. How does it feel, Harry, being out in the countryside? Can you describe Good. it for people? What does it feel like out here? It's very not, olive -y. It's lots of olives. <laughs> it's nice being back out in the country again. These small oh, villages wow. have got this like real sort of real cosy, um, yeah. friendly feeling about them. Yeah, and yeah. so we'll show you more as we go along, but it is beautiful. Yes. All, lots of the buildings are still in the original, made of like yep. the mud, and you can see the the walls here. Yeah. Um, there's olive groves everywhere. There's Each house has like a, a garden in their sort of backyard, like yes. a, a yep. backyard garden. And you can tell like um, everybody, like they say, oh, my uncle lives over here. My mother lived here. My Grandmothers. mother grew up here. So it's, um, it gives you 
you a really nice feeling of a small country village. Um, and and yeah. the most, I think that's so true. And I think the most special part about being here is that we are on an outing with our. Are we allowed to call you our Moroccan family now? <laughs> we were with our family here, but they have invited us out to show us their village and show us their yes. their town out here. Yeah, so. another one of those moments where that you could quite easily turn down and sort of go your own way, but you decide to sort of grab the moment and go for it. Um, put yourself out there, step outside your little your little comfort zone, and it always for for us anyway always turns into the best stories that the we best. hear. Look at this, this is so beautiful. So here, this is the kind of gardens, and because it has been raining, they're very green in there, and just beautiful. And anyway. like literally the home of um, earth walls, yeah. like earth walls and earth, yeah. earth built homes. Um, yeah. It's beautiful. All yeah. right, let's go for a walk. Wow. It's pretty awesome being out, yeah. out away from the town, away from it the is. tourists, away from the vessel. So, so, so these here, this is actually the argon tree um, where the little white nut from the argon tree comes from and it gets ground down into that paste, which I think... I so they make think argan oil They make argan oil Roger. and argan oil could be anything from face cream to your hair, like yep. body sort of lotion. And I think they, they use it, they advertise it in the hammam, they use yeah, it as well, yeah, yeah, but it's they, super expensive. It's super expensive. Last night we saw a jar of it, I guess, about yay big, and it was 40 US dollars yeah. for this jar. And it's sort of ground down into like a paste, almost like a peanut butter yes. sort of paste. Um, so this is the tree. This and is this the is also tree. the tree that you see... Um, all those sort of famous pictures, although we've just found out that a lot of farmers get quite annoyed by it, um, where all the goats climb over the tree, eating so the tree. So they're eating the argan nuts. They're actually or... eating the argan nuts, which the farmer um, doesn't like, obviously, but the um, sort of humatic people that sort of roam the lands with their goats allow their goats to climb up all over the trees and eat them. So, yeah. Oh, we're learning lots. <laughs> yeah. We learn something new every day. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and what seems like such the iconic picture as I know. Well. But look at this. So I think we're going to go up into the hills up there um, yes. to have the view down of the village from yeah. up there. So um, they were just saying a lot of these buildings that you can see over here, these original ones that you can see, um, are actually um, over 100 years old. Wow. So, I mean, for an earth-made house, so they just restore years. it each year sort of thing as they're going around. Yeah, well, just now. just maintenance like you do with any other building. Like, um, you know, like we have a home in New Zealand, which is 100 years old. It, it requires maintenance. Yes. So, I mean, these buildings here are like 100 years old. That is, I mean, for anything to withstand these sort of elements um, to last 100 years has got to be good, you know. It's pretty awesome. By the way, how's the shoes going? Oh, the shoes are good. <laughs> These feel good. They're very comfortable, super comfortable. And you can actually, I don't know whether you know this, but you can actually fold the backs down so you can just wear them like a pair of slippers. Oh, that is super good. So, yeah. Enjoy, enjoy your walk there. I am. <laughs> I may need a new pair after I've done some hiking in them, but they're super comfortable. Wow. This, wow, look at this. This is absolutely stunning. I am so, the king of the mountain. <laughs> so once we got up here, um, we were just talking, and we were, were we were pleasantly surprised. Well, we, we, it was it was good to know that it's too cold for any snakes and scorpions. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's definitely a good thing. Look at this. This is just so beautiful. Wow. Um, yeah, and I just said you can actually see how each place is like. Look how the actual yes. town is built, like surrounding the it's oasis like there. Through the water, through course. the valley. Yeah, like through where. But they're they saying like also it's not. It's basically, yeah, I guess, like a wadi. But they've known through over time that even if it does rain here, they're not in any danger. Right. Um, because there's never going to be, you know, because they're at, right. almost at the highest point. Yes. So they're never going to be like washed out. Um, but have a look down here in the distance. Like that There's is a whole clearly, another area there. Exactly. Yeah. So that I have a fair bit more water. This is as bird's eye view as we can get, but we can see quite clearly from here. Look at that beautiful mosque and minaret, like right yeah, in the middle yeah. there. I can see. Yeah. And another new one being built new over there. New one. New houses being built. Yeah. Yeah. How beautiful. And then look how green down here. I can see a solar panel just down in his garden down there with all the olive trees and oh, yeah, true, like yeah. a full olive grove. Yeah. Yeah, what a beautiful space. Yeah. 
Yeah. Right, it's over to the school, the local school there. Yeah. It's beautiful. Hmm. Just very cold. It's cold up here, yeah, Harry. Quite You've still got your sort of surfing sunny. tan from um, yeah. City Ethne, but now we are back it's, here. Um, it feels, it's, it almost feels unusual to be feeling cold. Yeah. Well, you know, not cold, but you know, it's probably, no, we I don't know, 15 degrees, 18 degrees. Yeah, and a little bit um, of a wind. Yeah, not complaining though, I feel like in this light, the city looks, the village looks even more beautiful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Okay guys, anyway, what I, I'm really missing from this video is that we haven't properly introduced how we met this beautiful family here and and how they invited us to come to their village and come and meet with them. So I'm not going to show Hasna on the film, but I just want to say a really huge thank you to the entire family for hosting us so graciously and um, we feel very thankful. So I'm going to let um, her introduce herself and tell you properly, properly how we actually met. Yeah. Uh, so, so hello guys, uh, I've been watching uh, videos uh, of the family stainers. Um, I asked uh, Sarah if they visited the Chisnit and she said she, they didn't and I told her that I will be there next week so um, uh, to show them around and that's what I did I went to the 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 so it's been a, a great experience for both of us <laughs> it was such a so pleasure much. for me so uh, that I had you in my house and I hope that, we, that you will come back inshallah next time and uh, visit other country, other uh, region inshallah oh, thank you so much Raul thank you shukran Hasna and the entire family there thank you and that was also in the beautiful Amazigh language which um, we haven't heard so much of and it just sounds yeah it just makes it that's the icing on the cake it sounds beautiful so shukran <laughs> So this here is the argan tree that we've been talking about, and if you can have a look through the branches, um, that's the nut. These so that's ones, actually the argan nut. That's the, the argan nut, which won't be here. ready until March. This is one here to show the yeah, size yeah, of yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And so that basically gets crushed down, um, and here's it's the oil they use out of it. And here's me showing it. Um, it oh, me I don't showing know if I will. Okay, yeah. this is, but this one is not actually ready, Oscar, but so they're very expensive, uh, so you can't waste it. This is what the... Um, and this is what the goats come to eat and so it's tricky for the farmers because they're worth oh, so much money so you can see the oil yeah. in it but that one is not ready so that's another needs another month or something to grow until yeah. it's ready yeah but so i can see why the farmers would get annoyed if um the goats were yes. coming to eat them all but Ma, yeah. i wouldn't touch it that much it's really sticky is it very sticky yeah oh okay july, good thinking yeah. right so oh so july. not till july. july oh so it's got another like six months five wow. months until it's actually ready wow. Wow. So, right, um, Sarah, look at this one. So, this tree over here, uh, you say this is probably about 300 years old. Wow. So, what about this one? This one that would be. This one can't be very much older than yes, that. Like, yes. this one must be 100 years old. This one that's uh, very old. Yeah, wow. so you remember this one when you were a child? Yes, yes. Wow. I, I, found, it, I found it all of them, but wow. this one, it's uh, the, the, the oldest one. Wow. wow. Yeah. So, 300 years old. About 300 years old. That's Which, my um, father told me I found it just like this. Wow. Wow. Yes. That's incredible. Wow, and I've actually, never seen them. It's funny because when you first look at the tree, you can't see the nut in them, but when you get up close, you can see it there everywhere. And, and I maybe bet, and the I whole bet from tree. the rain, it's turned so green. It is know, beautifully green. green. Soon it will turn. Um, soon it will turn dark green. Yeah. <laughs> and I bet if you're a goat, you would notice those ones. You'd absolutely so. notice. <laughs> we'll so keep how, it away from the goat. How hot does it get out here in the summertime? Uh, well, uh, how like how hot? hot? Yes, it's uh, maybe. 14, 35 wow. uh, wow. degrees. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so it's not quite as hot as in the I desert, yes, but um, yeah, yeah. But wow, that's super beautiful. hot. That's a dry. But, yeah. but all, uh, not all uh, summer. Yeah. Just, uh, some Just days. for summer. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. wow. Thanks, wow. Jamal. This is yeah. really cool. Wow. And also, everybody, look at my shoes. <laughs> Gav keeps mentioning his shoes. Shiny. Every yeah. other video is, look at my shoes, look at my shoes. You're very proud. They I, are. Might, I might buy some more. They are very cool, yeah. Gav. So that I've got two pairs. Yeah. <laughs> they yeah, are very so cool, yeah. They're so comfortable, yeah. <laughs> very cool. 
guys, look at this beautiful door. So it's actually like Pakistan. They, they have this door knocker and the woman would do it quite a lot. The, the, the so the women actually have a smaller one, I think. Yeah, so the men so have a big door knocker. The men yeah. can use this big one because it's very loud and then they might have a smaller one there for the yeah, woman the to use. Like yeah, so you know who's at the door. Yeah. So if you're a lady inside the house, you'd know, is it a lady at the door or a man? Yeah, yeah. so it's not like a New Zealand of guys. Yeah. You can't go. So what, but what would you do if you came to the door? Would you let someone in? You would do the big one. Yeah. <laughs> cool. Thanks, Oscar. And so this is a, this is, I'm just continuing on Oscar's tour here of the door. But so this is the old original houses here. So you can see the small windows there. And so those were actually the small windows for the ladies. So they could peer out and just check who was coming to the door. So they would know who was coming into the village, whether to let them in or not. But look at these beautiful old doors. There's a big old doors. This one's not quite as old there. But there's another old window up there. Some windows up here. And this is just a part of the village where the old houses are. Really special to see. How does the water feel? Really warm. So we had to come down all the steps. I'll show you the steps afterwards. We had to come down all the steps. Down down here. Here. Wow. So it goes all the way around here. So originally built by the Portuguese, but as a place for people to bathe and under the water. A bathe and under the ground. So you can under come the ground. in summer, if you come in summer or something. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. So you were saying, as a child, you would be here all day. Yes, yes, yes. Wow. The water comes from this, uh, this uh, way. Wow. Yes. So it comes from like natural There's spring and the ground. Way. Wow. And Where are you going? Go <laughs> from here. Just go a little wow. way in there. Yes. <laughs> wow. This is amazing. And we're quite far down. How many meters down to the ground do you think we're going to get? Uh, wow. Can, if you can go in, it's deep. Okay, it's going to get deeper yeah. if you go yeah, over yeah, that way. <laughs> Harry. But um, how magical. So what does the water feel like? It's, it's kind of warm. It's a little bit warm. There's this, um, the deeper you go, it's a little bit I mean, you can warm. Right. Do people still use it to swim in? People still use it to bathe in? Yeah, it's because wow. it's they do in the summer. It's very busy all day. Wow. And so there's a special time for the women to come and then a special hey, time for the boys to come, men huh? to come? Yeah, wow. No, it's up there. All right, we'll go back up and go, wow, this is really special to see. Wow. I'm actually quite jealous. I kind of want to. So it's knitting lighter. Wow, Harry, I bet that's pretty amazing. If someone came around here and stood and shone the light, I could walk that under would be there under the light. No, you're, you're on your own there. I'd be you're off to explore. I'd be an angel. <laughs> you're off to explore. It is yeah, see, quite great. See you guys. Okay. Wow. Does it kind of it's getting deeper? How deep does it go? Yeah, that's good. Alright, looks like it. Yeah, I can literally see it. And by the way, there's a really nice drop here. Yeah. 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 Put your tea in there, like... <laughs> 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 I can imagine it being busy in, in the summer. Um, over there, it's actually, it looks really... Looks Does it? Yeah, it's usually yeah. yeah. Oh, this is the entrance to the um, bathing place. So this says Arbelu. In Arabic, in Amazigh, in Arabic this one. Arbelu. Amazir. And here, this is the steps that we went down, all the way down to the swimming hole. Um, yeah, this is quite <laughs> unreal to see. You wouldn't even know it was here. So it goes a long way down. It goes a long way down. You wouldn't find this one, and then there it is. Oh, it even feels warm coming down here. All right, we're heading out. Mom, I need to come back down to wash my feet and put my shoes back on. Okay, come on then. 
So this is the old part of town, Sarah. This is the old street. This is so amazing. I know, it feels really strange. You can totally imagine how it would be perfect for donkeys. And yeah. these are still people's houses and like their yards and under here. And we're just learning about how they used to store things like really precious treasures or seeds, seeds and anything of value they would store it. And it was actually, they think it's like the oldest um, bank. Yes. In the world, like traditional Agadir. bank, is called and they call it Agadir. So that's where the name of that's the closest big city. I presume Agadir. that's where the name of yeah. Agadir comes from. Oh. But look at this roofway. This is amazing. Amazing architecture. Down here, yeah. These were the old houses. Yeah, these were like the old houses they used. Roofs. I think they're still people's houses in there. Cool. Shows are pretty amazing. You can even see and look the at the roofs. How the floors are made. Look at that. So this is actually a washing. What is the name of it? This uh, a saddle. A saddle. A saddle. So this is like a communal. I suppose a communal laundry for washing. Yeah. You can put your clothes so, right there and you start washing them. And it's just for the ladies. Yes, yes. So. so my grandmother used to come here so she can uh, wash her clothes, sheets, whatever it is in your house. You can wash it, you can drink it here. Wow, so much history. It's amazing. And it sounds beautiful. And here we are in the oasis. Wow, that is so cool. Wow, all right, so this is coming to another absolute highlight of this. What do you reckon about this, Oscar? It looks so good. So this it is couscous. Amazing. Not only is this our first time trying couscous in Morocco, but this is home cooked homemade. couscous. Yeah, so home home home, yeah. Yeah, yeah, homemade. And look how beautiful it looks. And the Wait, whole. What's that? I think it's Iran. Um, what is this one called? Uh, this is, um, uh, I don't know how we call it. It's Liban. Oh, Liban. Yep, is Liban. it like an yes. iron? Wow, you're right, Harry. Wow, it looks absolutely beautiful. So, it does. who's hungry? Are you feeling me, hungry? Me. Yeah. Oh, hungry. And can you remember what to say before we have a meal? Bismillah. 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 Well done, Bismillah. Harry. Very nice. It looks absolutely beautiful. Shukran, everyone. Thank you. Okay, this is, so this is the Liban. Look how, wow. Okay, Gavin, you're going to do the taste test? Oh, yeah. that's a giant bowl for the taste test. <laughs> I think you use a spoon. Ahu. Wow. Oh, yeah. What's the verdict? What does it taste like? Is it sweet? Mm. Or sour? Is it sour or sweet? Um, you want to try it? Yeah, here? it's like um, it's like you remember, you'll remember it. A little oh, bit sour. Yeah. Okay. What do you think, Harry? Perfect. Good boy <laughs> trying it. Okay, well done. And Oscar, just be careful it doesn't spill on there because it's a huge bowl of it. So it looks as quite a sort of thin it. texture like milk. Well, oh. <laughs> good boy, Oscar. Well done trying. It's quite nice. Quite nice? Good boy. <laughs> All right, and so now I've got to do the taste test of my one. Do, oh, shall I try and. <laughs> okay, <laughs> thank you. Okay, I'll do the taste test. I don't have quite such a giant bowl. Oh yeah, I love it. It's oh, yeah. so refreshing. I love it. That's awesome. Oh, thank you. I'm going to drink my one. <laughs> thank you. Harry's gone back for a second try as well. Yeah, that's good. That is so good. Yeah, he didn't like it. Do they make it? Is it like homemade or? Um... This one, not. It's not Sorry, homemade. Wow, oh, that's homemade. Wow. Okay, Harry, wow, the plate is looking quite a lot emptier there now. How really was lunch? Good. How would you describe lunch? Oh, that's very nice. And Oscar? I would describe it. Chips oh, that's very nice. It was absolutely awesome. And um, you guys ate lots of different vegetables and the couscous. How long does that take to prepare? Like, uh, How long does it take to cook? Uh, yeah. Wow. Oh, thank you. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Okay, so Harry's having his like dream come true here, learning how to make your favourite tea, Harry. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'm gonna like this one. Show you how. Okay. Now we're gonna make the water to be warm. Yeah. Oil water. Yes. Wow, this is really cool. We wait. Mhm. Mhm. And that's we call the bread. 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 Is and that a tea part? Yeah, we have we have the tea for green tea. Yes. Yeah. And here the sugar. Oh yes. look at this. Sugar. Oh, wow. And uh, this is the stone. 
Oh, is it to, so it doesn't... Yes, turmeric does oh, sugar. Oh, <laughs> truly. That is yes. so good. Wow. Winston, can I break some sugar? Yeah. yeah. So how's it going, guys? Is it almost ready there? Yeah. Almost ready. Almost ready? So show me, Harry, that's the tea. That's the stuff you put in Yeah, here. the tea. Yeah. Well, it's the tea, which you smells know, delicious. With your hand, or you, uh, or you, mm. you use this. Yeah. More. 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 Because we have a, a lots of people. Big, big yeah. one, yes. More. Oh, yes, 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 yes. More. <laughs> it's okay now. Okay. Now we and now we're just waiting for it to boil, or make, it's ready, or uh, we're gonna just wash uh, wash the the tea. Okay. With oh. a little bit of water, just like this. Oh. Yes. Oh, yeah. well done. Shake Mary. it. You know, just shoot me. Good boy. And you put it there. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Also, there's one glass for like washing. Oh. There's more. Like this. Oh, that's a lot of trust in the teapot going out. <laughs> we can not use this. Okay. It's a uh, test. And we're gonna make more, lot of water now. Yeah. Wow. Good on you, Harry. That's enough now. Okay. Now we're gonna put this into the fire. Now that, now yeah. that one's going to oh. boil. Yes. And we're gonna let them to, leave to it cook, now to, to cook it. Yes. Oh, well done, guys. Just the cleaning <laughs> one. Yes. Cool. Okay. It's now we wait. We wait. <laughs> now we wait. Yeah. Yes. Oh wow, it's boiling. Okay, so the tea is almost ready. Look at that. Yes. Oh, it looks beautiful. <gasps> and we're just debating what this kind of herb is over here, but I we can't remember. Fennel. You think it's fennel? I'm not sure. It smells quite nice. So Oscar, are you ready for some tea today? Yeah. Yeah, this is gonna be a special one. This is like the perfect moment. No. Okay. No, it is. Wow, good pouring there. Uh, just for to check uh, the the color, mm -hmm. if it come a uh, little bit red, it's mm -hmm. it's ready. Okay. Oh, okay. Nice. It comes a little bit It's like a sort of ready color. So do you think that one's ready, Harry? In your expert yeah. opinion, or not quite? Uh, not quite. Okay. Uh, yeah, okay, well, good. Oscar's getting a bit carried away there. This, so this is the sugar. How many pieces do we need, Jamal, for the tea? Uh, so as that, you like, as you right. like, yes. Okay, Oscar, whoa, easy there. Can I try? Oh. <laughs> okay, maybe. Can I try? Because it's going to go tea, everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> okay, Oscar. <laughs> Okay, thanks, Oscar. Okay. Wait, wait, wait. okay, wait, we'll see how yeah, it goes. You need like to this? put it in your palm and then smack it. Oh, yeah, okay. hit it. Oh. Just like this. Whoa. Okay, well Um, and turn, Oscar. And so, okay. Okay, a little bit of energy. Now take your sugar. sugar. Wow, this is the complete lesson, Harry. Like. Yeah, but it's... No, no, you don't need this one. Just More. Yes. How sweet do you want yeah. it, Harry? Yeah. Mm. Uh, Very right. sweet. Extremely. <laughs> okay, so this is the final step. Oh, it's heavy, Harry. <laughs> this is the final step of pouring the pouring the perfect tea there. Wow. Nice. Nice, Harry. And you're still a few pours off doing the taste test. Yes. <laughs> Put it back in for another time. Oh. Cool. Well done. <laughs> Again, if you want. The muscles, are you right? <laughs> Good boy. You need the big muscles. Wow, <laughs> well done, Harry. Yeah. In Sahara. Yeah, so Jamal was just saying that in Sahara they mix the, oh, what is it? They mix the tea. Uh, yeah, they use a small, small, uh, small jug. jug. Yeah. Okay. And they mix the tea in the many cups like this for, right. for this. Uh, uh, what should we call this? Foam. Uh, the foam. Yeah, yeah. Foam. Yes. Foam. Yes. Mm. The perfect foam. Yes. Oh, that's so interesting. Just like this. So they mix from one cup to the other, yeah. making it like that. <laughs> that's like this, yes. Yeah. 
Oh, nice. the like so this. the fine guys, Alex, see your vision. Oh, so this is from in okay, Sahara. Like yeah. yeah, so yeah. this was yeah. in Sahara. Yeah. But we need the small, small uh, yeah. bread and small uh, cups. Small cups. Yes. Yeah. Perfect. <clears throat> wow. It really is yes. the perfect cup of tea. So, so this is going for the final pour there. The final one. Do you think, so what do you think, Jamal? Has Harry got a future yeah, as a tea? Yeah, <laughs> tea <laughs> maker there. <laughs> really good? Yes. Yeah, uh -huh. no. Thank you for your patience. This is definitely, oh it God. takes a while. Woohoo! All right, now to enjoy the tea, Harry. Yeah. Okay. And you should, you should uh, give him all. Yeah. Okay, we've got to share to your guests first. One cup. Okay. Yeah. Well, we have had an incredible oh, day. Amazing. I am so full from delicious. We had the most beautiful couscous, couscous and, and tea. Lunch and and tea. I yeah. know Harry and Jamal made amazing tea. So we are leaving the village now and we are going to head back to Tisnet. But ending we with happy thoughts. It's actually raining yeah. in the desert. Which it is, is actually raining in the yeah. desert. And, and we're Tisnet. ending with happy thoughts. And they said that it didn't really rain much. I know, yeah. so when it rains, they're really happy. They're very happy. They don't get rain. Yeah. Even more green. But so this, they call their paradise, like it is an oasis out here. It's and so beautiful. It truly feels like that. It's more peaceful than the city we're in. It is more peaceful than the city and it just feels, I feel like we've been smiling all day. We've yeah. Been, yeah. So a huge thank you to Hasna, Jamal, your entire yeah. family. Thank you all, mums, aunties, grandma, everyone yeah. there for hosting us. Um, we yeah. feel... Well, guys, what was the highlight of your day? The couscous. The couscous. Oh, I like the tea. I, oh. Oh, I like the tea. I like climbing that mountain. I actually, oh, the mountain. I love, actually, I, actually, that's a good point, Oscar. Yeah, I, I love the tea. village. The village you love the I village. like the tea. Yeah. So, and this is, so thank you to the family for having us out here for showing this, but also thank you to Morocco for yeah. really showcasing hospitality again, yep. and yeah. we feel Once very lucky. Again. Leaving with happy thoughts. We are leaving with yeah. very happy thoughts. Do you want to wrap us up, and Harry? And full bellies. We happy will, thoughts and full bellies. see you on the next day. Don't forget to like and subscribe.